Alright guys, we're making a little video today on some special food for my cats. They're both over here, one's here and one's hiding off camera. But we're going to be giving them some treat here, a little treat, and it's wild sardines. Now, sardines can be bad if you buy the ones that are in oil or with lots of salt added. If you get the ones that are just in water with no salt added, <laughs> the cats are like, hey, this food, and they're kind of like, they always mess with each other, but they're nice to each other as well. Uh, if you get the one with no salt added, just plain water, no salt added, no extra ingredients, they're just fine. So it should be a nice treat for them. So I'm going to go ahead and throw some into their bowls here, see if they'll come over, and see if they like them. Some big nasty fish in here. Oh no. <laughs> Judd, mate. He's just like four huge fish. I think I'll chop them up a little bit. It looks like Dred's like, oh, what is this? He's getting it. So cats like sardines, that's for sure. My other cat should come over here. Uh, she's more skittish sometimes to eat right next to him, so he always goes back and forth from bowl to bowl like, oh, is this my food? Is this my food? But sometimes you can find sardines pretty cheap. I got these uh, when I was making an order for some uh, pantry items and weren't too expensive. And honestly, sometimes in stores, cat treats or dog treats, as you know, if you have a cat or other pet, can be pretty expensive for treats for pets. So sometimes you can just, just get some natural food that's uh, you know cheaper. You can do uh, tuna in water as well, if it's just plain tuna. Sometimes that's cheaper than buying some cat treats or or uh, other, you know, cat foods, wet foods, and, uh, you know, it's, it's healthy, it's just natural fish or natural meats that are, you know, only in water. You don't want to get anything that's too seasoned or anything like that, just plain in water. Hoping my uh, other cat, May, will come around. But, Dred, you like that, huh? Oh, let's just go back to this bowl. Oh, it smells like tuna in here. So, sardines pretty much just smell like tuna. Just gonna go back and forth from bowl to bowl and eat all the food, huh? If you're new to my videos, this guy's a pixie bob. You can see his extra toes. He's polydactyl. He's got his little thumb over here. And uh, my other cat's just a standard domestic black cat. But I just figured I'd show this. I've never given sardines to an animal before. And they definitely like it. I'm going to see if I can find May. But I don't know where she's hiding right now. Oh, she's over here. Let's see. She likes to sit and look out the window here. It's yours, May. It's not Dred's. I put it by you. Hmm. I'm pretty sure she'll like it too. Sometimes she's just kind of skittish about food with Dred over here because Dred always goes back and forth to each food dish. He's like, I don't know, it smells good, but... Dred's just mowing down. Oh, you went to the water, now he's, now he's drinking the water out of the sardine can, even though there's fish left over there. Is that good water? Making a mess. He's like, okay, I'll go back for the real stuff. And I guess my other cat's just... Not into it right now. What I'll probably do is I'll probably lock my black cat May here in the bedroom with this bowl and take uh, Dread out of here so that he can finish out there and May can have a bowl locked in here so she can get some if she wants. He likes that water though. Just back and forth. Alright, say bye bye.